music industry. I put something in one of my songs. Look at you, man. Uh -oh. And they can ask a lot of you sometimes. And I do what I can. When Connie Nelson calls, she wants me to record a song in the studio. Well, I'm there with bells on. You know, I met her when she was married to Willie Nelson. It's just great to have your family and friends in the studio making music all at the same time. It seems like an ordinary morning in Tuckerville. Grayson, Presley, and Layla are still asleep. But Tanya is out of bed and ready to break a sweat with personal trainer Chad. Okay, by the time I'm done with you, I want to be able to crack a walnut with your rump. Oh. There you go. Let's go back here. Oh, Lord, no, 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 no. There no. you go. Uh, okay. Oh, my uh, God. There you go. Jane Fonda, watch yeah. out. Oh. I know you were trying to quit smoking. How, yeah. how's, how's that going? And be uh, honest with me. Um, uh, 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 what, uh, pretty good. Uh, yeah, I bet pretty good. Yeah. Chad has a way of pushing me. Okay, that's it. That's good. That's awesome. Oh, my God. I mean, I know it's good for me, but gosh, it sure is brutal. Ah. Uh, I dislike very much. Hate's not a good word. I dislike this wheel. No. There you, that's it. Perfect. Uh. Good. No. Now you got it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh -uh. Oh, oh, oh. No. All right. Ah. All right. I can't. No. That wasn't so bad. Mm, that's the worst <laughs> exercise. It wasn't too bad. See, I would have you flip back I've over. I've ever again, done. Was, it's hard, isn't it? I would rather be whipped with a dead rabbit. That's that was a pretty good workout. Is that it? That's it right there. Oh, my goodness. How do you feel? <laughs> Energized after her workout with Chad, Tanya goes for a walk, armed with a power lunch. Mm. Hey, boy. I was out doing my walk, <laughs> my Chad walk. Hello. And uh, Connie Nelson called me. Hi. Uh, she's my sweetheart friend. She's a, such a such a love. She's also the ex-wife of Willie Nelson. Me? Well, <laughs> you ain't gonna believe this, but uh, I'm doing my little walk since I hate to jog. Connie asked me to record a song called Sleep Walking. It's a contribution to a charity album. <laughs> I mean, I'll just walk on over to the studio and do it. <laughs> Uh, let's do it. Okay. Bye. While Tanya wraps up her power walk, her 14-year-old son Grayson and his buddy Nelson are trying to stay out of trouble on the other side of Tuckerville. The first one to catch a fish has to get in the water. Tanya, her friend Nancy, and her daughter Layla drive to a Nashville studio to record a song for Connie Nelson's All-Star Charity CD. I brought Nancy to the studio. I don't guess she's ever been to a recording session. And, of course, Layla's been doing before many times, but uh, I, I thought Nancy would enjoy that. Sleepwalking. Tanya, Nancy, and Layla have arrived at Buck's Place, a famous Nashville studio, to record a song for Connie Nelson's charity CD. Hi. <laughs> when we got to the studio, some of my very good friends were there. Of course, Connie Nelson, who is my dear friend, Kind of a long distance friend for a long time. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. When I met Tanya the first time, I was married to Willie Nelson. Because of her schedule and because of mine, I don't see her all the time. But every time I'm around her, it just picks right back up. And you know, this was. Oh my God! <laughs> Connie knows everybody, and God too. And uh, she's introduced me to Gary. Hey, you, uh, honey. Gary wrote the song, and he's doing some background vocals on it, and he's basically producing it as well. I think we're good to go. Let's do this thing. <clears throat> what kind of mic is this? This is an AD, uh, ADK made in Germany, mostly for girl singers. Oh, ladies. really? Oh, well, you better give me a boy singer mic then. <laughs> okay. um, you, know, you know, we tried on my last album. We tried. I have an AKG C412, okay. and it's an old mic. Yeah. But if you've got one. Yeah. Yeah. Things have changed. It used to be a pair of nylons, you know. Yeah. yeah. I'm wearing those now, but anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I was here. Yeah. I was there. I was everywhere. Yeah. I was everywhere. <laughs> I was nowhere to be found. Someone wake me up. Up. Someone wake me up. Night and day. Day and night. Walking. I'm always involved as an artist on how I want to sing the song and how I want it to sound. And Gary's really open to that. Coolness. Okay, learn it, learn it. Yeah. You want to try that other mic, or do you like this one? It might sound better. You try it. Okay. You'll find out, I guess. It's such a great song for her. I just love it. 
Tanya's in the studio, ready to record her track for Connie Nelson's All-Star album. This is for my kids. There have been days, there have been nights, lots of heat. One more time. <laughs> now, you were directing me better a while ago. <laughs> Hey, Bob, punch it in at the... Will someone wake me up? Okay. Because up to that point, man, it was just okay. pretty. Here we go. Will someone wake me up? Someone wake me up? There are pictures. There are albums. There are memories. I am nowhere to be found Circus seals Spinning reels Training wheels But I was nowhere to be found Sleepwalking is about uh, spending time with your kids Someone wake me how we miss that if we don't do it. Someone wake me up. Sons and daughters grow so fast. When you know where to be found. To be found. Hearing her sing it, just her voice to me is classically perfect. Someone wake me up. Someone wake me up. To end the whole thing, I looked around and my little girl was fast asleep. Oh, look at my baby back there sleeping. Oh, it was a sweet ending. He wasn't joking. It kind of, I kind of felt, I mean, it was fun, <laughs> but I kind of felt bad after I did it. Back at the house, Tanya's at work in the kitchen, probably surprised that Grayson and Nelson didn't make a mess until it walks in her door. What happened to you? Those kids, they shot my ass up. Well, you can get hurt that way, you know? Well, I think boys will be boys. And I think Grayson and Nelson are a perfect example of boys. Hey, y'all. I, I, this is not right. I think you should apologize. Oh, I'm sorry, Kurt. Nelson shot you the most. Well, y'all won't do it again. Y'all don't do that again. I don't believe in letting kids get by with those kinds of things. As long as it's safe and nobody gets hurt, it's all right. But if, if it gets beyond that, then I'll have to step in. Well, Kurt, congratulations. You got the job. <laughs> I'm not sure he was too happy about that. You just can't go around doing stuff like that. If it's not fun for everybody, then it's not fun. Who told you that? <laughs>